Hey guys, and happy new year. It's, um, this is the same day, the second, the second, the first day of January. It's New Year's Day. I just did my BCS haul, and now I'm doing my second ever Zate bath haul. Um, that other video, I was drinking a beer, and now I have this concoction, which is tequila and pink lemonade. I know it looks disgusting, but I promise it's really good. And it's in a shaker cup because I'm currently moving like all my like nice glassware and glasses and boxes. So all I have is this like protein shaker. Like, I'm telling you, I'm just over here starting 2017 a hot mess. So anyway, let's get into the haul. My other Zate video, I set up the same way where I did it as an unboxing. And even though this is the same exact packaging, I wanted to do the unboxing again just to show you guys the consistency with Zate Bath and how beautiful it is every time you order. Um, my shipping, I think was like six something. She doesn't have like that $10 flat rate shipping, which is awesome. And even though it ships in a flat rate, uh, flat, what's it called? I don't know, the USPS bag, you'll know what I mean. The regular like um, padded envelope. Um, she puts this little box inside the padded envelope. So your stuff always comes flawless. It's never beaten up. It's like double packages in the boxes in the envelope. So it's just so pretty to open. So anyway, you open it up and you see the tissue paper and it says, thank you, Merry Christmas with the little reindeer sticker, which is so adorable. And then you open up the tissue paper and you see the cards and the like um, Easter grass in the Christmas colors. So anyway, the cards, first we have her business card. So you see Zape Bath, so you see pronounced Zape. And I did see on her Instagram that Zape actually means soap in Dutch. So if you are ever curious as to the name. So scent, soap, soaks, bath and body. Her, I just, I love Zape so much. I think everything about her website, her wax is so cute. Her packaging, like just so much thought goes into this. And I know she, um, this is just her side thing. She has a full-time job. I think she's like a nurse or a nurse practitioner or something. Um, I could be wrong. But anyway, I know she has like a legit career and just does this on the side. So then you get this and it's like handmade with love. And this was in the other one too. But this time she did add this really sweet handwritten note. It says, Lindsay, Merry Christmas, love, Ashley. Which I think is so awesome because I can only imagine how many orders these vendors get and I can only imagine how much time it actually takes them to write handwritten notes to everyone placing an order. So that little step goes a long way and is so much appreciated by me. I think it's so sweet when they take the time to just personalize it. The only thing I'll say about this order is the last one. I did get a sample with it and if you remember that and you're wondering where it is, I did not get a sample with this order but I mean, it is what it is. Like, it's so, I don't know if like they always do it or they do it sometimes or like it's the holidays. Maybe she was just busy and had it but forgot. But regardless, that doesn't matter to me. I mean, samples are sweet gestures, but I buy the wax that I want. Like, you know, samples are just whatever. Like, they're nice when they come, but you know, I'm just saying that like because I noticed it, but I was just like, eh, whatever. And I didn't want, like, if you saw the other video, if you were like, well, what happened? How come that one had it? How come this one didn't? So that's the only reason why I'm acknowledging it. So anyway, let's get into it. <laughs> this is so cute. I love this. <laughs> Her packaging is amazing. Like, amazing. So anyway, first here we have Wasted. So this was her like Christmas slash New Year's one. And that's why I placed this order. So this was mostly the same sense as the last time I ordered with like maybe two or three new ones. But there were a couple in here that I was like, ooh, I didn't get them last time or I wanted a backup of it. And then the new scent sounded so good. So it's like, I have to just place the order. So again, super cute um, labels. And she did change her packaging. So she has these zip top bags. She's like trying to get away from the fold over ones sorry, that she had in the last video that I was like, oh, I don't really like these type of bags. So she does listen to her customers and is changing them over. So here we have um, Wasted is pomegranate, raspberries, cranberries, bubbly champagne, and apple cider donut. And her descriptions are always so cute. And I think this one was like when you're drunk, like at three in the morning and you go get like apple cider donuts, like after like drinking champagne all night, like something super cute like that. So there's the bag and the, oops. <laughs> adorable label and here's her wax and her wax is another testament to like how much I love her stuff it's always so super cute so these colors are perfection like pink and gray can't be beat 
just so pretty and I think her wax is paraffin it's super super rock solid and this gorgeous silver glitter on top of the pink and gray like this is just so pretty this chunk is gorgeous and the scent oh my god the scent is incredible you're hit with that tart pomegranate cranberry immediately and I don't really get her fizzy note which is good because even though I like fizzy scents, I don't like when that fizziness is overwhelming and it's all you smell. I would rather smell the fruits and whatever else is in it and like a background hint of the fizzy. And this you get a background hint of that apple spice, like that clovey cinnamon apple spice of the cider donuts. Oh my God, it's just so good. This one is just absolutely incredible. And actually, I'm just gonna leave it out and leave it like this so you guys can stare at the wax because it's just so pretty that I don't want to just like get rid of it like it should stay in the video because it's beautiful so next in here is sleigh ride and I believe this is one of the ones she had the first time that I didn't get and I was looking back on the descriptions and I was like this looks really good and look her wax like the glitter matches my nails so you can tell like this company was just made for me like it's the type of glitter I love so sleigh ride is Christmas treats, sweet peppermint, and toasted marshmallow. This is incredible. I remember when I first got this box like two or three weeks ago, um, I could only smell like the spice, like the Christmas treats, and it was that like cinnamon spice. And now I can smell the toasted marshmallow and the peppermint, and it's all come together and smells amazing. So again, of course, another stunning chunk. I mean, look at that, the light gray wax and that deep, crimson cranberry red and again the super pretty like iridescent sparkly glitter on top just stunning and her chunks are huge and yeah this like when I first got it I smelled the Christmas treats first now I'm getting that peppermint first and I'm getting the toasted marshmallow it's like imagine you were burning like a cinnamon spice wax marshmallow fireside back in another room and a Bath and Body Works twisted peppermint like all together that's this oh my gosh this is just incredible and I feel like with even more cure time it's just gonna get better to me I think Zape is really the best with like two plus months of cure time like maybe one month but I've only melted it after two or two or more and it's just like been so strong and so awesome so definitely a wax that you want to let sit so the next was, I saw this description and I was like, I have to go ahead and place an order because this looks so good. And this is Pop the Bubbly. It's a super cute label here. And this is Juicy Pomegranate Berries in Bubbly Champagne. Like you cannot go wrong. I love pa uh, pomegranate, like the champagne, the berries, bubbly, like it all just sounded incredible. I was like, yeah, I need that. And this giant snowflake is just so, so gorgeous. Like, wait till you see it. If I can open this bag. I don't know why that was so hard. And her labels are just, oh, I love them. Look at this thing. Like, stunning. And this is huge. That gorgeous gold glitter, the pink and the yellow. This is just so pretty. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I think this, this is the same snowflake mold that BCS uses, like with her new snowflake things. So gigantic, gorgeous. Oh my God, I just love it. And the scent. This is like fresh, fizzy, berry goodness. Her pomegranate is so candy. It's like candied pomegranate. It's absolutely fucking phenomenal. Oh my God. And that's like fresh berry deliciousness that is just I can't even describe how good pop the bubbly is like and I think she's gonna have this her January restock I may be wrong but I'm like I'm pretty sure it's coming back but if you ever see this get it get it get it get it get it it's just that good so next is this giant one and this is bad Santa <laughs> that label is so adorable. A little top of Santa with his beer. And this is Fireplace Wine, Orange Spice, and Sweet Treats. And again, just get ready for another like stunningly dropped dead beautiful trunk, uh, chunk. Like her wax is just so fucking gorgeous. I can't even take it. Put that guy right 
here. Little Santa bag. Like, just look at this. This just screams Christmas. Like, this just looks like a beautiful, like, candy cane. Look at that chunk. And the glitter. Oh, my God. She does, like, just the right amount of glitter. Like, it's just so pretty. I love the, like, chunkier glitters like this that really pop. And this just smells so yummy. So just because it's in my head, like that vintage chic Carol of the Bells, it's that same like dry cinnamon clove type scent, but just imagine you had that basket of potpourri and poured fresh squeezed orange juice over it. That's what this smells like, like juicy berries, fresh squeezed orange juice and cinnamon and clove, but they're equally balanced. Like you got the same amount of both of them as opposed to that Carol of the Bells that to me is just like straight up. Um, like cinnamon clove because I said in that video I was like I wish it had you can see how gigantic this is like my hands are huge and look how giant that is I said I wish that VCS had um more of the pear scent in it because it would just balance it out and be so much better and I feel like this is what I wish Carol of the Bells smelled like because this it's just balanced so perfectly and it's so juicy but still has that spicy cinnamon scent like I'm probably going to save this to melt on New Year's Eve next year even though, like, I know these are, like, the bubbly champagne scents, for whatever reason, like, the orange juice just reminds me of mimosas, but, like, it still has that Christmassy spice vibe going on, that this just smells like New Year's Eve to me, the bad Santa one. And I think the last one in here, I think there's only one more. There's so much left in here. Yeah, this is the last one. So this was my repurchase. I mean... It's my second time getting this one, but I didn't purchase it myself. I had won this scent in a giveaway, and it was actually the first time I ever tried Zape, and this was the scent that made me fall in love with Zape Bath. You guys know I am not really a fan of vendor coffee, but Zape's is different. It's similar to the Super Tarts coffee, but like, like I have said, like coffee smells like almost like stale popcorn to me, and this does not have that at all. This smells like walking into a Starbucks. Like it's that super strong coffee scent, but so much better like and this one because it has the whipped cream it has that creaminess that i need a coffee scent to have so it's just pumpkin spice latte top it with whipped cream i could melt this any time of year any morning that i need that pick me up and i want my home to just smell like a starbucks like this is it and that's exactly what it smells like it smells like no joke walking into a starbucks or like a local coffee shop like creamy and coffee and deliciousness and you can see these things are humongous. This wax is gigantic. So that is it. That is my Zape order. And I believe this came out to like $20 or something. Like this was a pretty cheap order. Her stuff is so reasonable, reasonably priced, I think. Um, I think she has really fair pricing like for the amount of wax that you get. Her stuff is awesomely strong if you give it at least two months to cure. Her packaging is just stunning and beautiful. Shipping is reasonable. She ships everything beautifully. You're never going to have anything like dented or like chipped or fucked up. Like she packages so well. And then she also does like the point system where every dollar you spend, you get points. You can apply it to your next purchase. If it's your first time buying from her, you get 10% off, which takes a little off your shipping. And you can see like it's just it's so beautiful. It's just it feels like Christmas morning every time I get a package from her. So I would highly, highly recommend Zate Bath. She's definitely jumped up to one of my top vendors. I just love her stuff so much. And she does have a restock coming up in January, which I'm so excited to order from. And yeah, I think that's all I have to say. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.